What's going on guys? It's your boy coming at you from the squeaky roller chair once again. Just hopping off some Xbox right now. Gonna show you guys this beautiful whiskey I got on my way home after my workout. Super excited to show you guys this. Uh, it's been popping up on my Instagram here and there. Um, awesome looking bottle. We're gonna order it off Instagram, but I decided to go into this smaller-ish liquor store down the street where I got some of the other bottles. And then lo and behold, they had it up there sitting on the top shelf. Okay. Top shelf, keep that in mind, okay? This is one's gonna be a little pricey, but it's definitely gonna be worth it. All right, guys, please remember, if you guys like the content, please, you know what to do. Like and subscribe. Um, I actually have a video of me playing video games, so I don't know if you guys are into that. Again, this channel is, we're shooting from the hip on this channel. All right, you know why we're in the kitchen. We're gonna do some dishes. I'm gonna vlog myself doing some dishes. Jesus Christ, I'm disgusting. Just kidding, I'm not gonna do that. Anyways, let's get into this bottle of whiskey. It's a super awesome bottle. Really excited to show you guys. Let's flip this around real quick. Look at that beauty. Not gonna touch it yet. Look at that beauty. Okay, it's coming a little bit. Get the little tag. Really cool. If you guys get this bottle, please make sure to read it. It's really a. Uh, it's pretty down home, Texasy. Talk. Speaking about Texas, you got the star right there. Garrison Brothers Texas Straight Bourbon Whiskey. Really cool bottle. I like the top. You know, I'm a sucker for a nice top. It's that wax, that waxy candle top. Little, little pull-off thing here. We'll do that on camera. This is cool. I went on their website. I did a little research on this one because it was so expensive. So I saw some dude initially. I don't know if that's the distiller or anything like that. Again, no research done. I don't know if that's the guy who bottled it or something. But yeah, super cool. A little signature thing like that. They use one of those uh, paint pen things, I think. This is cool also. Has Texas born. Texas corn, pretty cool. Let you guys take that in right there. Bottle number, I don't know why I like that. Release date. Re the front's awesome. I like how you can, the star right there, you can see the through it. Super clear, beautiful looking whiskey. It's pretty interesting, so I usually don't do this, but I looked at the tasting notes and it had a like, just different style than what I'm used to. Um, had like some fruitiness. I think at the end it said it's supposed to taste like some an espresso, some cake and different. We'll get back more into that into there later. But what was really interesting was they use rainwater. So there's rainwater in this. It's pretty awesome. Anyway, so let's get into tasting it. That's what you guys really want. Real quick guys, I missed something on the aesthetic and I really wanted to point that out. I love this. Homegrown handmade small batch bourbon whiskey made with the finest Texas corn and hill country rain aged two years in slow growth northern american oak harvested from sustainable forest that's cool i really like that it's a flex it's like hey we're doing our part not to do too much to the earth right, guys, so quick spin around again love those words right there it's super cool this is awesome i love the star and then the star on top it's great not gonna lie to you guys before i started recording i had to kind of pull this out it was really hard come around jesus like that though it's kind of cool it's like working for it oh that's great that stayed that top part stayed i don't even care that it broke uneven who cares it's good to get that pop oh that's sick i'm so excited let's smell it out of the wall oh wow that smells okay the last time this happened i was reviewing the bib and tucker all right here Get that coffee, that vanilla smell. Oh man, this one beats the Bib and Tucker for sure. Let it air out for a second. Pour that. Oh wow. I really hope you guys can hear that dum -dum 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 sound. Awesome color right there. It's great. Smell it. I don't know if you're supposed to swallow it around, but I'm going to swallow it around. Oh wow. It's really harsh at the beginning, but... Take a deep breath of it, you get the harshness and the vanilla at the end. Oh, wow. I can smell the coffee a tiny, tiny bit. Not too much. Let's taste it a little sippy sip. Wow. Uh-oh. It's going to be an expensive habit. This one is delicious. First taste. Get that little spike of smoke. Can definitely taste the wood. It's awesome though. It's a great flavor. It explodes. It's awesome. Uh, then after that, it kind of rolls into that vanilla, -y, just a splash of vanilla, 
and then you um, do get that it, on the website it did say that I had to copy nodes at the end didn't get it too much but maybe if you have it at the maybe on the big sip so let's try yep <coughs> wow a little rough but it's freaking delicious that's great and yeah on the bigger sip you can definitely get the coffee at the end I'm sorry not coffee espresso this is awesome whiskey this was worth drum roll drum roll drum roll drum roll it was worth the 88 something dollars I paid for it. This is delicious. This might be my new spoil yourself. Do not drink this unless it's a special occasion. Oh man, I wish you guys could smell right here. It smells great. Oh wow. I'm gonna finish that little drop right there. Yeah, that little drop even too. Got a little more splash of the smoke, the coffee. Yeah, at the end is wow, that's crazy. It's a really great whiskey. Oof, ten out of ten. I don't give tens. Jesus Christ, don't worry about my. Oh my lord. And it's crazy because I usually don't like to look at the tasting notes because I feel like it kind of puts something in your head. I did do that, but usually when you see look at the tasting notes and then you taste something, it sometimes like you won't taste it personally. I don't know if it's because some people's palates aren't um, up to par, but that one literally tastes exactly how I said it was gonna. Garrison Brothers, link in the description. Uh, again, you guys probably know this. I don't get paid by anybody. I literally do this out of my own money. It's kind of an expensive hobby. Not gonna lie to you guys, the other bottle I have is another 80 bucks or something like that, but it's worth it. Getting good whiskey, making sure you guys spend your money right, especially during this time. All right, guys, left-handed. Oh, well, let's see if we can do this. Ugh. Anyways, I appreciate you guys. Garrison Brothers, 10 out of 10. Go buy it if you got the money. It's 90 bucks, a little pricey. It's all good, looks great in this wonderful target glass. <laughs> Anyways, I appreciate you guys and cheers.